What's your first memory? N not the one from a photograph or that story you're told again and again, but the one where you realise you're you? This is mine. Have I told you this before? I'm... We're still in KL, we haven't gone to Penang yet, and I'm standing in grass. I must be about three. And the grass is singing, and it's very far down. And I'm a giant in the blades of grass, and each blade of grass is a thick green tongue licking at my legs. And I'm walking towards the edge of the world, which is curved and very far away. And there's a butterfly bumping against the edge of the world trying to get out and it's white and it has blue papery veins and someone holds my hand behind my back and I want to go towards the edge of the world so I pull my hand away I remember being quite cross and then when walking each step is a giant step towards the very far away edge of the world and then someone holds my hand again by my back and I'm twisting and turning around and I can't see who it is and I <laughs> tug my hand away and I carry on walking across the huge huge blades of the grass and then someone holds my hand again and I twist round and I see that it's me holding my hands behind my back Now, I've told you, and it's just a story. It's not true anymore. I don't resent you. I, I wanted to tell you. What's yours? I'm making this film because I want to tell you about my new show. It's called A Lie, and it's about the fact that we are all made of lies. I'm a gigantic, colossal liar, and I imagine that you are too. Which of these statements describes you some of the time? I talk too much when I'm nervous. When I'm on the spot, my mind goes blank. I've said I was too tired to go out when really I was broke. I have said I was too broke to go out when really I just couldn't be asked. I delete my browser history. I have urinated in an ocean while standing next to someone else and having a conversation. So I'm a poet and I love making spoken word and I work a lot with live audiences. But in this show, what I really wanted to do was to get that incredible feeling that poetry on the page gives you, which is the feeling of paradox or of two impossibilities existing and being true at once. I worry that I will be found out for being a fraud. I get in trouble for being honest. I believe my own lies because it is more convincing that way. In spoken word often you have to be um, quite direct and you have to tell a story that everyone can get immediately because you take everyone on a journey and I do do that and I will do that but I also wanted something more from this show. I wanted that feeling of magic and wonder. I am always myself with my friends. I believe my friends are honest with me. I have been honest during this questionnaire. 